Charlie, maybe we should get rid of some of this shit. What? Yeah. What'd you say? Get rid of it? Yeah. Frank. Look at this. Huh? Yeah. This, this. Look at that, bro. Yeah. yeah. This shit is our future, man. People are just throwing this away. Get rid of it, dude. Frank, we start getting rid of this, we're gonna be just like the wasters out there. Hey, hey, hey. Guess what? Somebody else is gonna find it. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right. Where are we gonna sleep? Get out of here. Look, Dennis, look, look, Dennis, look at Chuck, this. Look, I don't look care that. about that, it's all right? Like you guys are making me look like an asshole. I'm out here trying to make a difference, and you're over here rummaging around in the trash like a couple of narcs, okay? You can't just come down here with your mainline cashmere moose quaff hairspray and start being like a suburban tool. You can't. What are you, are you saying, okay? man? Did are you, you even look at this? I, I don't know. I think I just got punked out by a couple of hippies. I gotta do something about this. Whoa! A sneaker. What size? 14. Throw it in the pile, baby. Right in the pile. Oh, Charlie, isn't this great? We go right to the source. Forget oh. about the dump. Yeah, screw the dump, man. Yeah. It's, uh, it's right in your backyard, dude. This is it. What's that? What's that? What's that? It's another coat, man. Oh, can I have it? <laughs> no. Well, you already got one. Frank, use your head. This is the coat that's going to protect my other coat. Come on, man. <sighs> So oh, look. when you're right, you're right. Yeah, baby. <laughs> You'll find one. If you keep digging, you're gonna find one of these. I've got no idea who DB's dad is. I don't know. Oh, dad. God, no. It isn't me. I'm I mean, sorry, I don't think but it your is. son no, just does not look Latino. Oh, well. I mean, that, that's a bit of a disappointment that's, for that us. Makes me I mean, sad. yeah, because we're truly trying to give him a future. Is there anything that we can do? Well, not unless you can change the color of this baby's skin. Let me get this straight. You want to put your baby into a tanning bed. That's correct. I'm sorry, that's against the law. Look, pal, we are well aware of the law, okay? We don't want to jam you up here. We just want to put him in there for a couple of minutes. Just to get a base. Just to get a base. We'll sign whatever waivers or whatever you need us to do. So let us cook him for a couple of minutes and we'll be out of your hair. I'm feeling compelled to call the authorities. Oh, are you? Well, then why don't we take our business elsewhere? I sense some judgment in your voice, sir, and I don't appreciate it. You could have helped change this child's life forever. You chose not to. That's on you. I can live with that. Come on, DB. I guess the road to stardom is paved with hard knocks and orange assholes. Skin needs to be darker, Dee. Yeah, I know. We're just gonna paint this bronzing lotion on him. Shoe polish. Shoe polish? Shoe polish. Shoe polish on a baby? You're such an idiot. That's gonna look stupid and smell like shit. We'll see. Where's DB? My door's open. Did he get kidnapped? Somebody came in and took him? There's a note. There's a note. Take it, baby. Meet at later bar, night or day, sometime. Charlie! Charlie. Feast your eyes on this. Hey, Sage, buddy, how are you, man? Uh, how are you feeling? I did. I, I saved the tree. You sure did, man. You saved that tree. Wow, I gotta say, man, I'm really impressed. I don't think I could have done what you did here today. I'm a hero. You are? You're a hero. Yeah. Come, here. Come here. Come here. Come with me. Man, it is a good day to be alive. It's a good day to be alive, isn't it? <laughs> okay, guys, she's all yours. I want to see this. I banged your girlfriend. I'm talking about a rat. I'm talking about a little mouse. I'm talking about a rat. It's still with no, a little mouse. No, little mouse fighting a scorpion. And that is final. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Oh my god, I don't care. All we're doing is arguing about the most stupid shit. A rat, a scorpion, I don't care, man. Uh, when did this start happening? Dude, a yeah, link! Baby. I mean, I am actually gonna be able to look down and literally see how many yards I'm running. Oh, yeah, this is gonna be awesome, dude. We might actually get further in this little tryout than we thought. Yeah. You see how many Yahoos are trying out? Oh, yeah, yeah. I've seen a lot of people wearing capes. There are like 15 guys wearing capes. You seen that? Why would you wear a cape? What, what advantage does that give you? Absolutely none. none you know, right? I have a little respect. We are here with the Philadelphia Eagles, and they are opening up their doors to us. I mean, this is a boyhood dream. I know, I know. Why even come out of here if you're not gonna take this somewhat oh, yeah. seriously? I mean. I'm pissing no, no, I haven't even started pissing because you're standing next to me. You're talking to me. It's making me nervous. All right, and I can't. All right, I can't all right. Do you want another beer? Yeah, give me another beer for Christ's sake. You're not drinking another beer? Yeah. I don't give a shit.
doesn't shit! Okay, I'll take an knee. I'll take an knee. We're doing these trials for you because of your harassment and your love for the new kids on the block movie. You paid your $30 fee, we promise you a keynote speaker. All right, bring him up. Julie! Uh, it's good here. Yeah, that's cool. Just put your park break on. <coughs> Donovan McNabb. Hey guys. I'm Donovan McNabb. Uh, I play quarterback for the Philadelphia Eagles, and I'm here to tell you that you can too if you start every day with a hearty breakfast from McDonald's. Uh, like the new sausage egg McGriddle value meal, available now for a limited time for under $5. Uh, remember guys, real champs, eat at McDonald's. I'm loving it. <laughs> Can I get the check? That's good. What the hell was that? Thanks, Donnie. <laughs> that was not Donovan that McNabb. That was not Donovan McNabb. Yes, it was. It was like a McDonald's plot. Was that the guy was... from the Cosby Show? Was, was that the guy from the Cosby Show? Terrible shape. This is going to be a lot easier than I thought. Oh. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Move oh, it. So much pain. Ugh. All right, now we got our hearts pumping. Let's pick out some gear, pick a partner, hit and drill. I pick Cole. Oh, oh no, he did it. Oh no, he did it. That's my dance. That's my signature dance. Yeah. I'm going to do that when I tackle people. Yeah. Woo! I like your form on that, and yeah. I like how you went before the whistle. Goddamn right. Nice. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Let's pick new partners. Uh, Eeny, meeny, miny. Mo. Oh. Nice. Hustle. Way to hustle. All right, who's next? This guy. All right, run out and hook in. Run out and hook in. Show these people how to play football. I'm going to make Mac look so bad. My form is perfect. I'm like Jerry Rice. Feel that stride. So fluid and fast. I've got the stride of a gazelle, a beautiful, beautiful gazelle person. My body is achieving a perfect symmetry right now. It's that long, lean muscle I've worked so hard to achieve. I should have popped my shirt off. God damn it, I really should have popped that shirt off. I wonder if any women are watching from the sidelines. I think we're in the middle of something very I got news, your mother is dead. Yeah, right, nice try, very funny, Frank. I'm serious this time. She had a botched neck lift. She's as dead as disco. <laughs> Who wants champagne? Today, it's good to see all of you. Yeah, that's quite all right, sir. Don't worry about it. Listen, would now be a good time to say a few words about my wonderfully warm and caring mother? No, just you know, get to the Let's reading part. Get on with it, man. Let's go. All right. Uh, which one of you uh, is Frank Reynolds? Go. Okay. Uh, Frank, I have something here that I need to read to you from Barbara. Hmm? Frank? If your fat monkey heart is still beating, uh, then congratulations. I want you to know that I hereby leave all of your money to Bruce Mathis, the real father of my children. What? What? Bruce Mathis? A handsome man with a beautiful soul <clears throat> and a nicer penis. You're giving all my money to that jerk off? You know, Mr. Reynolds, I'm reading what's on the document. Why are you okay? giving it to him? I'm not she barely even knew him. Yeah, I'm not giving any money to anybody, you see. I'm just reading what's on a will. Where is that rat bastard? Sir, I don't know. Because That's I want to smash his face until he's dead. Kill dead. Frank, we kill forget dead. about Bruce. I want to just give away all of our money. You know what? We should just move forward, okay? For my darling son, Dennis. Hmm? Presumably. Hmm? Uh, I give you my house. Yeah, okay, well, yeah, now it's starting to make sense. Read on. On the sole condition that Frank not be allowed in. I would never let him in. What? I... Deandra, yes. you get nothing. You were a disappointment and a mistake. A mistake? We're twins. Yeah. We were born at the same time. What are you talking about? You're not making any sense. Tell that bitch it doesn't make sense. Okay, I'm reading the words that someone else wrote, okay? I don't know your mom, never met your mom. In fact, I'm certainly not speaking to your mom now. 
Because she's dead. Yeah, we know she's dead. We're venting because we're frustrated. You tell her she's a goddamn whore. Ooh, okay, that's always I, been a whore. Well, well, well what, know, about, what about jewelry? Does it say anything about jewelry? It does say something about the jewelry okay. in here in that um, she wants to be buried in it. God damn that's, it! Oh, 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 God damn it! She's taking it into the grave! Tell you what, you son of a bitch, I am very disappointed in you today. She's very upset with you. You angry? tell her for me that I will be in touch with her somehow. Yeah, tell her she's a bitch! These are awkward situations often, and I know it can be difficult. Hey, thanks for the house, dude. You know, you know, I didn't give you the house. That's not how this <laughs> yeah, whole situation you works. Did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Jesus Christ. Bro, like, we need to start the healing process. Okay, I'm devastated over here. We need to throw a big ass party because I need to be amongst my friends. Let's call the crew. Let's round the boys up. Round the crew and up. Let's have a kick ass party. We got the diary. And the boys are back in town. The boys are back in town. Boys are back in town. Boys are back in town. I have two numbers in my phone Charlie and Dennis. Huh. Hey -o. What's up, bitches? Matt, can an asshole rip in half? Like tissue paper. Hey, you guys! Back away now! Whoa, 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 what the hell are you guys doing? Oh! oh okay. okay, okay, don't shoot, okay? Just take whatever you want. Yeah, take the cash register. Take the girl. Let me take the girl. Hey, don't argue with He's them. Right, just go. go. You better just go with them. But they're not trying to take me anyway. Don't try to be a hero, D. Just do what they say. They're not saying anything. Well, what's this? Is if you keep arguing with them, then we're all gonna die. We don't want the girl. Then take the cash. We don't want the cash. Well, what the hell do you want? We're taking you bitches hostage. Uh, look, we need to watch out for each other, okay? The only way that we're gonna get through this is if we stick together. Nobody has to die. Somebody has to die. Oh, yeah. It doesn't have to be one of us. No, it shouldn't be. It means we'll be Mac or Charlie, right? I mean, what do they have to live for? Not one thing. So, we need to form a pact. No matter what happens, you and I have to stick together. You and I will form an alliance. We'll form an alliance. Dennis is gonna try and have you killed. I can't say that surprises me. Well, he's gonna sell us all down the river. Okay, should we kill him first or well, look, something? Look, I don't want anybody to have to die, but if somebody does, there's no reason it shouldn't be Dennis. It should be Dennis, yeah. right? He, he had a great life. Oh, yeah, he had a sure. full, full good ride. Oh, a fantastic ride. I had a terrible ride. Charlie, you had the worst ride. I had the worst you ride. You deserve another could... shot at the ride. I want a better ride. Oh, you had a ride and ride. Okay. So listen, here's what we do. You and I, no matter what, we gotta stick together. We gotta stick together. We should get to Mac, though, before Dennis does. Oh, Mac will be with us. Mac will be with us. Frank, Frank, come in, Frank. The McPoyles have taken us hostage and they're threatening to kill all of us. It's too late for the guys, but there's plenty of time to save me. So come down. Ah, here we go. Charlie, what are you trying to tell me? If here by now, then bad place be. Trouble time for you when he comes. Jesus Christ, the kid's an idiot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, shit. What was... Oh. There's a chance that we can survive this if we just stick together. Okay. All right, all right. Time's up. Looks like Mag and Dennis tank it. Nice. Blast away, boys. No. No, wait. Wait, think it's Charlie. Charlie destroyed the office. No. Oh, my, look. Charlie oh. saved my Blast life. Him. Blast no. God damn it, Charlie. Be very carefully, Frank. Charlie has escaped. Repeat, Charlie has escaped. I think he's gonna come after you, man. Don't worry about it. I can take care of myself. Oh. God! I just stepped in glass. There's broken bottles all over the place. Broken bottles everywhere? Oh, shit, dude. I think you're in Charlie's bad room. What the hell is that? It's where he goes to be alone and break bottles. Dude, you gotta be real careful. He's gonna find you. I can take care of myself. Hello, Frank. I gotta call you back. Be careful, be careful. Hey, hi, Charlie. Looking for your will, Pop? That's exactly what I'm looking for. You know, it's funny what kind of men we turn into in circumstances like this. I heard who you wanted to have killed. But that goddamn Mac. And tell me, Frank, what do you think about... this? I like that very much. That's exactly why I came up here. No, it's the... 
Oh yeah, I guess it is. Now let's get the hell out of here! No, I don't think so, Frank! You see, I don't need you anymore now, do I? What are you talking about? What are you doing? Put your hands down! Yeah. Charlie, put your hands down! Yeah. Charlie, don't lie, Dad! Oh my God, do you carry that everywhere now, dude? That's ridiculous. Lead me the hell out of here! All right, fine. How? This way. That way? Put the gun. I was gonna go that way. No, that would have been all wrong. There she is. Dee, wh what are you doing? I'm having you arrested for slave labor. Slave labor? Yes. What the hell are you talking about? Well, you bought some dresses from my brother Dennis that were made in a sweatshop in the basement of our bar. Do not listen to a word this woman says. She is stark raving mad. She's a goddamn lunatic, okay? Those dresses were made by voluntary laborers who work for us on their own free will to feed their starving families in their home countries. In a sweatshop. Nope. In a sweatshop, Ingrid. It is no, a sweatshop a which makes it's... you the biggest loser, Fatty Magoo. What? I didn't buy anything from your insane brother. Really? What? Really. So, let me get this straight. Dennis has been lying to us the whole time? I don't know, and I don't care. Wait a second, Fatty Magoo. Are you Ingrid Nelson? Yes. No shit! I'm Mark Dunlap! I knew you in high school, wow! You look terrific. Thanks! And that would make you the aluminum monster. Oh, man! You were all jacked up, huh? I remember. Remember that with the back brace ugh, and all that metal? <laughs> I mean, you were like... You were like an aluminum monster. Thank that you. really was the best name for it. Yeah, the only much. name for it, really. <laughs> you were so cute. Aww, it's thanks. a lot of metal, man. Hey, hey, I used to know your brother. Now, he was a pretty cool guy. Whatever happened to him? Behold a winner and all his... <laughs> Shit. What are you guys doing here? Endless and timeless. Dude, we are in big trouble here, man. Oh, shit. Look at that door, dude. See that door right there? One marked pirate. You think a pirate lives in there? I see a door marked private. Is that the, is that the door you're talking about? No, I was talking about... Yep. I didn't say... No, did you, you What did you hear? I heard you say you saw a door marked pirate. Yes, and is there a that's pirate I, living in there? No, see, that's not what I was saying. Well, look, look, are we going to talk restaurant? about pirates all day? Are we going to find out what lives in there? We're the one that... Jesus Christ. Oh, okay. Right. Um, as I was saying, when, when I went down to your bar the other day, nobody appeared to be working there. I mean, there were people there, but they were just customers who seemed to be serving themselves. Right. We're out and yeah. about a lot, bro. Get yeah. to the point. Right. Yeah. Well, we here at Media Restaurant Group really think that the location of your bar would be a perfect spot for one of our oldies rock cafes. Shit, dude. How do I explain this to you? I um, don't know. This bar, it's who we are, all right? Amen. It's all we've got. Yeah. You life. wouldn't understand that. Yeah. Because you corporate pigs think you can just buy everything. But you, you can't, can't buy everything. Yeah. We you know you're kind. Everything. The big businesses mm -hmm. just going all over town, swallowing up all the small guys. Well, guess what, pal? Patty's Pub can't be bought. Okay. Well, if you would just please take a look at our offer. Yeah, man. <laughs> we'll take a look at it. Sold! Eating. In touch. In touch? Why would you read that crap? We are trying to stay in touch with what's happening in the world. Yeah, I'm sorry if we like to keep ourselves informed. Yeah. You want to be informed? Read a newspaper. Dude, yes. and nobody gets their news from a newspaper anymore. Uh, no, 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 but Dennis, look. Plutonium smuggled into Syria. <sighs> That's going to change my life drastically. It's going to change everyone's lives. No one can go to Syria anymore Ooh, for vacation. Boo. Don't you guys get tired of doing nothing except sitting around drinking? What is that? How could you ever get tired that of that? Is that a joke? I don't understand. Hey, oh, what's up, bitches? What Turn is it? Turn the TV on right now, dude. This is huge. Turn the TV on. I'm going to be on the news. Oh, my God. Dude, there was an accident today, and then the news talker asked Mac what happened, and he totally went off, dude. I went off for like 20 minutes. It was amazing. I totally popped, right, Charlie? Oh, popped. you popped. You're going to be famous. Wait, here it is. Here it is. Wait, shut, up. Up. shut up. Shut up. This is Ken Jacobs coming to you from Market Street, where two buses collided just minutes ago. We talked to one local resident who had this to say. It was absolutely crazy. Police are currently investigating the cause of the accident. Back to you, Jim. No, what dude. was happening in the world? You can make better news. We no, could, dude. Charlie. Do you want me to grab my camera? Yes. Do you want me to grab my Just camera? Just like the old days. Let's go out there. Let's, let's make some news. I want in on this action because I am bored to death sitting here. No, that's a bad idea. Usually when you get involved, somebody gets hurt. That's ridiculous. I'm just palling around with the guys. How's anybody going to get hurt? 
Why does it drag us to a place like this? It smells like the bottom of a birdcage. Oh, lots of shady shit goes down in nursing homes, Frank, okay? These places are like prisons. Like people getting ass raped? What? Oh my god, dude. No, no one's not getting like ass raped. People getting Frank, ass come raped. on, man. No, it's so the people don't want to be here because they feel like they Because they're getting ass raped. No, he's oh, getting ass raped, Frank. Geez, the love of God, man. All right, come on. I'm a little. All right, look, we're locked and loaded here, man. I'm okay. ready to shoot this thing. Okay. Stop this one. Let's go. Come on, let's move. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna do like a catchphrase thing, okay? Yeah, ready? In here we go. three, two, one. Good afternoon, Philadelphia. This is Matt coming to you live from the Malvern Retirement Home. Go, 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 go. Hello, miss. What's your name? Irvine Simon. Hello, Irvine. Why don't you tell us what's really going on here? Cool face, hold it, hold it. Well, I get up around 5. 5.30 if it's bingo the night before. Then I eat breakfast. I like to have fruit. She steals the grapes. I do not. Check a purse. Don't okay, interrupt. Okay, I think we've covered breakfast. Let's move past it. Good save. Then after breakfast, I like to sit and read recipes. I don't even know how to cook. <laughs> Is there anything that you want to tell the world, Irvine? My grandson's birthday on Friday. No, no. Is there anything about this place that you don't like? The blacks. Cut! 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 Cut what that! What are you cutting for? That was just starting to get good. No, it kidding? was not good, okay? It was the ramblings of a crazy old racist. Is it hot in here? I meant to bring this up. Wait. How are you sweating so much? It's freezing. Is it? Yeah, it's they, freezing. They, they try to keep them alive. Because meat spoils slower in a fridge. Oh, so they keep it cold. All right, yeah, that interview was terrible. Oh, it was terrible. No, we need I, a more exciting truth. We do. Yeah. Let's set this place on fire. Now you're talking about a pandemic. Bird flu! Bird flu! I think he's choking, guys. <gasps> what? He's choking! He's choking! <laughs> Frank, Frank, give him the I'm not gonna touch him, I don't know what he's doing. Charlie, you know the Heimlich? I don't know, I'm gonna punch him in the stomach or something, dude. Okay. <laughs> oh, 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 baby! You okay? I did it! Woo! You did it! I saved your life, bitch! Woo! Yeah! That is exactly the kind of stuff we should be filming. I'm a hero. You got that, right, Charlie? Yeah, you got that, right? Oh, I did it, I did it, Frank! Well, I, I did it, I did it. You were pointing the camera at him, right? Yeah, you got it, right? The yeah, punch and everything, right? Yeah, no, I, I, did, I did point the camera at it, but you know what? I did not put a tape in here. What? What are you talking about? All right, well, the problem was that I got the flashlight on and I taped the whole deal up and I realized I'd have to cut all the tape off to get the tape in and I didn't have much more duct tape, so I figured, uh, you know, stick with the flashlight while we got it. <sighs> So you well, never put a tape while we were out there in the nursing home outside. outside. Oh my God! See what's happening Nothing. here is we're getting yelling and yeah, we're gonna get yelling. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm oh, I forgot to put a tape in. I forgot to put a tape in. All right, all right, right. All right. But here's what we do: we recreate your heroic moment. That's it. We do it again. We just recreate. Yes. yes. This time. We put a tape, tape in. in this thing, yes. <sighs> Take the Re light off of it. Yeah, maybe we don't sweat so much. Maybe we'll have to and wear a well, little more makeup. Don't blame it on my sweat glands, okay? Right, well, That's we'll, not we'll fair. We'll just recreate the whole thing. All right, let's... And, and you could, you know, you could... Yeah, this well, time you... I could... I could look a little bit more heroic. You could yes. look a lot more yes. heroic, yes. bro. Yes. Yeah, yeah, we'll put enough makeup on you, you look like the shit. All right, let's All just right. make That's some it. news, please. All right. We're supposed to wait and get drunk inside the club, not outside the club. Nobody gives a shit about a stupid drunk whore outside of a club. That's a lot of talking you're doing. I gotta lay down. Lie down? What are you talking about? What are you doing? D. Oh. <laughs> well, now you're just some stupid drunk chick lying in garbage. Night. Night night? Night night. Great. Wanna come in with us? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Here, take this. What is this? <laughs> You'll see. We're sitting around here practicing like a bunch of pansies. We should be out getting wasted and breaking shit. Frank's absolutely right. How can we be rock stars if we're not living like rock right. stars? If we live like rock stars, the music will come. Okay. The music will come, okay. Charlie. Okay. Whoa, 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 stop, dude. What are you doing? That's my good chair. That's your good chair? Yeah. It's covered in bird shit. No. <laughs> That's toothpaste, That's man. clearly bird shit. Uh, it's not as toothpaste. Do you even own a toothbrush? I, I... <laughs> Look, don't break oh, yeah. oh, 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 Wait, wait, wait a minute. Charlie is right. 
We should not be breaking our own shit. We should be out there breaking other people's shit. That's rock and roll. get a hotel room without putting a credit card down. We did use a credit card, man. I took it out of your wallet. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Are my credit card number's down at the desk? Yeah! You mean we're smashing up a hotel room with my credit card down at the desk? Why, why, why would you do that? Uh, they don't let you book a hotel room without putting down a credit card, Frank. What year do you think it is? <laughs> well, we gotta put this stuff back together again. What? Get the glue. Charlie, uh, we gotta get the glue. Get the glue. Awesome, Give me the glue. No, it's a part Give of the process. Glue. That serial killer killed another woman last night. Really? It said, yeah. It says here he's targeting young, attractive blondes. Okay, that's it. I'm not closing the bar by myself anymore. Oh, Why? Well, I don't really think what you, you have anything to worry about. You don't fit the description. Yeah. I can't believe you've actually dressed like a clown. You're gonna draw so much attention. Well, I thought we were getting into the killer's shoes. Yeah, but the killer's not a psycho clown, D. All right, that's only in movies, stupid ones. Oh, really? John Wayne Gacy? He was a psycho clown. He was an excellent one. Good on, work. Uh, yeah, actually, See? right. He was. He was pretty. Okay, okay. Here she comes. All right, this is the fun part, D. This is the okay. part that we've been working up to. This is what all the work has been for. We're gonna follow our victim. Uh -huh. Okay, then we're gonna jump her, and then I'm gonna strangle her, and you're gonna chop her into pieces. <laughs> okay, but what are we really gonna do? Huh? We're not really gonna kill her. What are we gonna do? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. That's a bummer. Yeah, you're right. And the trap is set. Sweet, bro. What the hell are you doing? Siphoning boxed wine. Why? Why? Bro, this is the perfect plan, man. Dude, if we get your dad drunk enough, he's gonna be able to see past your mother's looks, past her skin, all that eczema and shit. He's gonna fall in love with her all over again, buddy. Now, my mom, she gets so belligerent and mean when she's drunk, dude. She's gonna drive Frank right back into my arms. Into your arms? Into my, into my home, into my futon, into my house. Into my, I'm gonna have Frank back, is what I'm trying to say, dude. Right. Where'd all these jars come from? I emptied out all the tomato sauce. Hmm. Seems to me like it'd be easier to steal the box than jars of liquid. No, no, the jars, it's, you empty. You know what, where were you 10 minutes ago when I was coming up with this plan, man? I don't think you can call dibs on a shady people smuggler, Yeah, so. you can't do that. Just do not mention my name. My Relax, God. dude, no one's gonna mention your name. Hey, Bingo, Frank sent us. Frank, huh? I'm gonna skin that son of a bitch and wear his face. Anyway, what's up? Well, we're Oh, don't look at me. Excuse me? Look up, up. Okay. Is this good? That's fine, this is... now speak. Uh, okay, uh, well listen, Bingo, we got a bucket of nose clams fresh from the sea. Sweet, delicious nose clams that are looking for a home, if you follow me. No, I don't follow you. I don't know what the hell you're talking about right now. It's not confusing. Just everybody settle down. These are the kind of nose clams that make you want to dance the night away. I don't get what the hell you're talking about. You're talking it's about. so obvious. Oh, I, oh. Well, you know what? It's not obvious. Now you're being too vague. Okay. You're talking about Our, dancing uh, clams. I'm trying, trying to, to make you dance. Right, because these are the kind of nose clams that you crush up into a line of white powder and you snort them up through your nose and they make you high. You use a dollar bill or a straw to do it. They come from Colombia. They're illegal and they rhyme with propane. Perfect. You found a perfect medium ground there. So you want to sell me cocaine? who sold the drugs? And we can fix the lights now. The lights are fixed. Yeah, man. Oh, shit, how'd you do that? We got bigger problems than that, dude. The drugs that you just sold, they belong to the mob. What? Yeah, they saw you yeah. guys. Guys, real life, actual gangsters. It was pretty cool. They came to the bar, they it threatened us. It was not cool. And that, look, the point is, we're gonna give them the money that you got from Bingo, so it's no cool, you know. And then maybe we can keep a little for ourselves, too. Yeah, well, how Perfect. much did you get? Oh, is it, oh, do one, a uh, two, a uh, three hundred dollars. Oh, my God, you guys, those drugs are worth 25 grand. Oh, shit. Are you serious? Oh, yes. See, no, I told you, I asked for more money. What? Yes, I did. No, you didn't. I was using dead presidents as a cover. You didn't get that? He said to the man he wanted many, many thousands of green people from history times. I happen to have a whole shitload of it. How much? Twelve hundred. Oh boy, that's wow. gonna. Bingo. Goodness gracious with this wow. guy. If it's not one thing, it's another thing. Oh, okay, yes, I know. Okay, but uh, think about it this way: if we split it, it's only a few hundred dollars each. Great. Yeah. Sorry. Right, let me just go grab my dollars? cash from my money tree. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I know. Leprechaun has a pot of gold. Yeah. He's, he, yeah. he lives at the end of my street. Maybe I'll go to a <laughs> bank and say, "Hello, do I have an account here?" Call Donald Trump. Trump. <laughs> How do three men in their thirties not have eight hundred dollars between them? 
they're... Okay, there's only one thing that these rich old men understand, and that is money. So I'm going to play the role of a high-powered executive, mm. and you are going to be my secretary, Linda. Oh, no, no. I will be your business partner. Dave, these guys are old school, okay? They don't like women's rights. Now, don't give me any lip. Okay, Linda, first thing I need you to do is get Jameson on the phone and tell him I don't need a $650,000 investment. He can shove it right back up his ass. Ooh, I got a better idea, Bob. How about you do it? What's that? Yeah, I think you should get Jameson on the phone for me. Well, why would I do that, Linda? You're my secretary and a woman. <laughs> what do you know about investing? Oh, I'm sorry, Bob. Remind me again what we're having Jameson invest in. Jameson is investing in new technologies. Really? Which ones? Lasers. Lasers? Yep. That is adorable. Lasers, Linda. Who wants to buy some drugs? You guys got the right idea with these. It's like the perfect mix of comfort and wind resistance. Yeah, they make that in men's. <laughs> huh? I think it's men's. No. Yes, men's. No. Hey, listen, guys. I was thinking we could add a patties, you know, put the squeeze on them. Yeah, well, we're right in the middle of something right now. Don't you guys do anything besides play cards and eat deli meats? Go wash my car. Oh, <laughs> fellas. I feel like I'm being seriously underutilized here, you know? Look, if you just give me a chance, I could show you how hard I actually am. What? Yeah, that's right. I'm so hard that people are scared of me, and they should be, because I'll explode all over them. Oh, oh what's come on, on, what's the matter with you? Yes. I'm eating here. What? Well, what are you talking about, your dick? My dick? You know, I'm talking about my brute force and my cat-like reflexes. You hear that, Anthony? Huh. He's got cat-like reflexes. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Hands like a cat. Mm. You know what? I think someone just turned themselves a nickname. Huh? Really? What? Yep. From now on, you'll be known as Pussy Hands. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to go on record saying I don't like Pussy Hands, but uh -huh. I think Cougar Hands would be good. <laughs> Here's to you, Pussy Hands. Uh, that's great. Then it's settled, okay? Mm. Hey, Pussy Hands, go wash my car. Uh, <laughs> how about Jaguar Hands? No. Nah. Leopard Hands? No. Nah. Panther Hands? No. Nah. God. Damn it. <laughs> Go get your saucer of milk, honey. He does have gorgeous hands, though. <laughs> Don Sal? Yeah, what? Forgive me for speaking out of line here, but I don't think I'm being properly utilized within the organization. I mean, I've, I've tried to be eager and work with a smile, but I don't, I'm not making any forward progress. Aren't you the janitor? It's not important, Don Sal, but what is important is that I get out on those streets and start doing some gangster shit. I mean, there's gotta be like a union boss I can put the squeeze on, or a, a truck I can hijack, right? How would you like to do me a personal favor? Sounds shady. I'm in. Good. I need you to go over to my house and take care of my wife. You mean the grubber out? No! You want me to bang her? Oh. No. Oh, I'm sorry. What the hell is wrong with you? Why would you say that? that? That's the communication problem. Okay. What I need you to do is just go over there. Like a protection thing? Yeah, it's something like that. Yeah. Okay. I mean, uh, you don't mind getting your hands dirty, do you? Absolutely not. Good. God damn mafia. 